everybody, this is Tim from Mainly Muscle Cars along with cameraman Ken. And today we are looking at a 1970 Bronco. Uh, really cool Bronco, lots of recent work done on this one. It's got about 250 miles now on a rebuilt crate engine and rebuilt transmission. Uh, transmission was done at Tom's Broncos. Uh, a lot of different work has went into this one. Um, Everything from basically a new paint, uh, new interior, kind of a fun one. This one's done in kind of a unique taste, kind of a stormtrooper look to it, just with everything being white and black. Uh, it has upgrade wise, it has of course the LED front headlights, uh, we have LED tail lights on it. Uh, basically just uh, a lot of different stuff that make that updates the truck. Uh, it's been updated with disc brakes in the front, it's been updated with power steering. The steering linkage has been upgraded with a, a DOM style with a Heim joint, which basically that's a steel tubing with a Heim joint. So a very, very strong setup. Gear wise, this one has four tens. Uh, it has a posi in the back, so very capable rig. Uh, tires are a good all terrain design. They have, uh, these are the Toyo AT2s, just a really, really nice driving tire, uh, rated extremely high. They've got a mileage warranty, I believe, of 65,000 miles. So, a really good performing tire that's quiet, it's going to last you a long time. Uh, let's see here. Exterior accessory wise, of course, we've got the heavy duty bumpers. These are Tom's Broncos Impact Series. Uh, very tough bumper. These have been powder coated, so a very durable finish on them, uh, very scratch resistant. It does have a trailer hitch setup, so definitely enough power on this one to pull a small boat. Uh, weight wise, I wouldn't recommend a large boat, it's just kind of too much. You don't want to overmatch the weight of the tow vehicle with the boat. Uh, good power has the, you know, so if you're going to tow, it has the NP435, I believe, transmission, and that one has a compound first gear. So good to get out of the hole. Good thing is with these 35 inch tires, you still have enough power to use it and drive around well. Okay, firing it up. Extremely easy starting truck. Just very, very easy. Just touch the key. Even this morning, um, been driving this one home. Just uh, depress the gas one time, touch the key, boom, hit up right on fast idle. Uh, warmed up nice. Just tap the gas. Comes off. Runs nice. Uh, new clutch in this one. Uh, of course, you know, transmission's rebuilt. Typically, you just take off in second gear with these. This one actually has a usable first gear. Lift wise on this one, we have a uh, nice three and a half inch suspension lift on it. That's a Tom's Bronco kit. A good compliant ride. It is not a squishy rig, so it, you can actually handle corners in this one fine. Some of the Broncos you get out there and they are very, uh, very squishy. So when you get into a corner, you have a truck kind of leaning on you. And it's pretty disconcerting if you have an inexperienced driver or you're not used to it. So if you're looking for something for the wife to drive or a young driver, uh, definitely stick with one of the stiffer sprung Broncos. You'll have a lot better luck with it. But it cruises along nice. Um, all the gauges work, speedometer works, the heater works. The headlights are phenomenal. These are a JW speaker headlight that are in this. And they have a, uh, it's an LED style. So this is the same lighting technology you'll see in the 2015 cars or the higher end German cars, you know, starting around around 20, you know, 2011, 12. Very good headlight, LED brake lights. The cool thing is all the lights on this one are smoked, but as soon as you touch the brakes or turn the lights on, those rear tail lights are light enough where it really shows through nice. But pretty steep hill, it comes up no problem, nice note to the exhaust. Shift to fourth though, and just kinda lumbers along just fine. Nice smooth ride though, nice tight steering, good truck. We did unzip the rear windows, just kind of show you guys what it looks like. Um, really nice addition to have with a soft top as you're able to pull that, uh, you know, pull the windows out, pull the back window out so you get a nice breezeway. And as well, you also get to uh, have like a bikini top for it that covers your back passengers. Most bikini tops only cover the passenger and the driver. 
And if you have kids, you know they don't always like to be in the blazing sun, and that can take a lot of fun out of it. But with this setup back here, you get anybody in back, they're not getting beat to death with the sun or the wind. So you still get all the uh, openness around you without all the sun getting the backseat passengers. Uh, also, we have fully lined carpet that keeps a lot of heat out of the truck. So if you live in a hot area, this is a really good combination. Uh, the white paint is much cooler than a dark color. Uh, and then you also get the shade. Well, anyway, lots of cool stuff to talk about. Uh, give us a call at 360-863-2241. Or you can visit us at the website at mainlymusclecars.com.